Okay, guys, so I just watched the One Piece Netflix adaptation trailer, and holy shit, this is going to be a shit storm. I don't even know how to really explain this in a way where it doesn't say, I don't say I told you so, which honestly, I haven't even told you what I meant, so just hear me out. Most Netflix anime adaptations, which try to bridge the gap between anime and reality, there's a big issue, is that you can't really mimic it IRL, which I know you might say, hey, Caleb, Marvel is doing that at a really good rate. Yeah, they make cinematic masterpieces, but I'm guessing Netflix, since it's such a, a company of, let's say, Black Mirror and uh, a lot of, like, dating shows, when they try to bridge into something where it's more comic-y, like, kind of like DC and Marvel, it just doesn't work out. Like, the people that they casted for this show, I have to be honest, man, it ain't it. Like, you see Luffy, Luffy doesn't even look close to Luffy. And I don't have an issue with the person, I don't know the guy, but I'm just saying, the way he's talking and his energy, it just doesn't give me, like, Luffy. And I don't know how many people they... Are they cast it for his role, but I'm just saying that the people that they, he did cast, they didn't do a good job. I saw what they tried to do with the trailer. If they did a good job, I would have let you know right off the gate. But then let's just go straight into Twitter and what they're saying about what's going on with this trailer. Chris P said, the next person to say, hey, this actually looks good. I just want them to remember this. Yikes. I feel like this is going to go down the same path that Cowboy Bebop definitely went down. It ain't it, Chief. Do my eyes deceive me, or is this looking kind of de- <laughs> Stop the cat. Stop it. Stop. No. Okay, I'm, I'm pretty sure now what, what I would th be doing if I was Netflix is I'll have my team of, like, people with social media just, like, making a bunch of fake-ass accounts and saying some shit on this. He's fucking capping. It, it ain't it. You know, I think the reason why I'm not really liking it as much is because you, you see where the bar is set. You see where the bar at, is at. You know, you got Luffy, the dynamic knucklehead who just eats a shit ton of food and is rubber. You see Zoro, who's just like a signified badass who kind of looks like he's a part of a K-pop rap group. Or probably BTS. And you got Nami, the, the person who's just obsessed with money. She's a bona fide fox. I didn't really sense that energy from her either. Which, no, no offense to the characters being casted. Hey man, get your bag, guys. It's Netflix. They got money. But I'm just saying... At least cast the right people. It ain't it. Maybe it might change when I see the actual show. It might change. But from the trailer, the minute something seconds that I watched on this, it felt a little cringe. Which, the acting might be amazing. But from what I heard in the trailer, it ain't it. Even him saying his, his freaking ability didn't sound good. Which, that in its own is going to be really bad. I'm, I'm, I'm projecting a bunch of memes coming on Reddit. Which, I know Reddit is kind of under shit fire storm with a blackout, but people are going to come back and kind of uh, revive Reddit just to talk shit about it. And honestly, I'm probably going to be there with it. I don't know yet. Why does Buggy look like he belong in a horror movie? Honestly, I feel that. Which, I think they're maybe just trying to make him look more like um, something from Pirates of the Caribbean, but that doesn't really scream Buggy to me, because uh, you're, you're bugging if you think that's Buggy. Simple. I'm not even a One Piece fan, and I feel offended. <laughs> Damn. You know what's crazy? I, I feel offended too. It's like, it's not even that it's bad. It looks cinematic. It just doesn't give me Luffy. Like, what is he doing touching the lamb like that? Like, don't do that. It's just his facial expressions just don't really match Luffy. It just ain't it. It's like he's looking like he's discovering, don't touch her like that. And why is he in an overall? So he doesn't, I've never seen. Luffy ever touch overalls, bro. He, he has the iconic shorts with the freaking flip-flops. The, the Jesus sandals. So in the comment section down below how you feel about watching the trailer, which I'm going to link it down below in the video so you guys can go to it, write something about it, and then eventually come back here and we discuss about it. So, like, yeah, make sure you go do that down below. But let me know what you guys think. I just told you guys what I think about the trailer. Yeah, this is not looking that great for me, but I think that maybe it might potentially do well. But... For what I heard with the voice acting and stuff, hopefully the story is solid. Because if it's not solid, this is going to be the, the next meme or the next Cowboy Bebop. Okay, that's it, guys. See you guys next week.